Hey guys, this is Alex Stevenson here, and we are at ANS Vegetarian, which is a <clears throat> vegetarian restaurant here in Da Nang, Ho Chi Minh City. And here we're actually getting some of our food. Come on. Uh, here with Kyle hey. and Chris. What's up? And this is what we getting. So, what have you got there, Kyle? I've got spinach pasta with mushrooms and cauliflower. It actually and looks really good. Yeah. And um, fresh spring rolls. Nice. Just the Japanese udon style of uh, noodles here with mushrooms and we got the sweet potato as well. Yeah, sweet potato bowls. That actually, this stuff looks great. I've got the barbecued tofu with also kind of make your own spring rolls type thing. So yeah, there's actually a lot of good vegetarian and vegan restaurants here and I've been going to quite a lot because of uh, these guys who eat a lot of vegan, um, which I'm happy to do. It's like really good food. So yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm here now at the beach at the Fisherman's Restaurants, which is an ironic name because it is actually a vegan restaurant, right? Or vegetarian restaurants. And I'm here with Kyle. Hey, hey. We are getting some lunch here. And it's pretty awesome. It's like right here by the beach. Uh, we got the, the sea over there. The decor's nice. Got these little chairs. Good spot and it's in Hoi An. So, um, you know, Da Nang is in that direction where I've been living slash staying <laughs> for the time being and uh, that means it's about a 30 minute drive to get here. Pretty chill, hop on a bike, it's a Sunday and you walked all the way here. Yeah? It's a 30 minute drive or a five hour walk. I left at six this morning just to see if it would be possible and how it would be but the sand gets really hot at 9 a.m. so now I know if I want to do it again I might like take a grab here, eat here for dinner or lunch and then walk to Da Nang from here in the evening where you can finish off in the dark, cooler time. But yeah, it was very meditative and just nice to be alone for five hours in the sun on, this, on the beach. <laughs> well, it is cool that this whole stretch is walkable. Yeah. I love the atmosphere here. You got this ocean breeze coming in, plenty of comfy seats. And the menu is huge. I haven't had a chance to try everything, but I've been here like four times <laughs> and everything has been amazing. I just had a breakfast burrito and uh, crispy potato. Crispy potatoes with spinach and chickpeas and mushrooms and it's all just so healthy. But it's pretty good. Smoothies on the beach. This is a coconut, pineapple, banana smoothie. Really good. The whole stretch here goes all the way around to Da Nang and it's really cool to see um, the city on that side there and then obviously the old town here is is here in Hoi An. There's so much going on in terms of like stuff in Da Nang to do and then you can come out here, there's really good little villas and if you watched our villa, villa video, uh, you can rent out a villa here which is really awesome. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this now. Hello. Hello. <laughs> How are you? He just like tucks his arms away and he's like, I'm just chilling now. This one? Yeah. We need some energy in the sun. And then last but not least, we have Loving Vegan, which is very centrally located here in the Mi An area, which is near all the Antung streets. That doesn't mean anything to you. It's basically the touristy or expat kind of area uh, that has a lot of cafes and restaurants. It's, it's a really nice area close to the beach too. This place has a really good menu and it's also very well priced. I think most dishes are like 50 to 70K, thousand dong, which means it's, you know, $3 maybe on average. 
and you know a really good meal so that's good value for money I would say and there's always people there it's very popular so I just recently got the banh mi chai I think it is which is vegetarian banh mi which is if you don't know what a banh mi is it's either uh, egg filled or pate filled or there's a few different types of ingredients you can put inside inside a French baguette uh, great Vietnamese food and this was a you know, vegetarian version of it and it was really good. I would also recommend checking out the barbecue cauliflower which sounds weird but I guess it's designed to be as a sort of replacement to chicken wings. Uh, it doesn't really taste like that but it tastes amazing so if you go there definitely check that out. So those are my top three recommendations of places to go in Da Nang or Hoi An for vegetarian restaurants. There are a lot of other restaurants these are just some of the most popular and the ones that I've been to and been recommended that's always a good way to find good places to go. Uh, a lot of my vegetarian friends recommended these places and go there often but of course you can find other places if you want to search for them you can always type in C-H-A-Y, uh, that is Vietnamese for vegetarian or vegan. And I'd just like to say a big thanks to our sponsor today, uh, Ninja Teacher. You know, they're a great company, uh, I'd highly recommend them if you want to go teach abroad and get TEFL certified, so you can go check them out at ninjateacher.com. Yeah, no, that, that's a joke because this is Ninja Teacher. This is our channel, that's our company. We don't turn YouTube ads on in these videos or do sponsored videos for other companies. So if you are looking to support this channel and start teaching English abroad yourself uh, or online, you can start teaching English online in the meantime before you move, move to Vietnam, if that's something you wanna do, uh, then you can go check out our TEFL courses at ninjateacher.com. All right, that's it for today. Stay tuned for more videos about teaching English and life abroad, and I'll speak to you soon. Peace.